Hey everybody, so as you all know, my channel, Leafy is Here, was banned a few months ago. Now, whether or not that was fair or bullshit, I'm not gonna go into that because... Leafy is here is back. I never thought I would say that ever again. Everyone knows who Leafy is. Everyone knows he got terminated a few months ago. Unfairly, may I add, there was no excuse for what happened to his channel. His channel didn't deserve to get terminated. And I was one of the people who said, you know what? This is unfair. This should have never happened in the first place. This has to be a mistake. YouTube sticks their guns as they like to do, and they kept the channel down. And as soon as that happened, every single YouTuber and Twitch streamer came under the fucking rocks and started shitting on Leafy. Oh, I'm so glad that leafy got banned let's go leafy got terminated no more cyberbullying no more this no more that and these are people who were silent they were silent when pokemon was going with leafy in the greatest anime battle of all time fucking better than naruto versus sasuke but as soon as leafy got terminated all of these motherfuckers came out and started shitting on leafy you love to see it these fucking hypocrites these fucking twitch streamers and youtubers who hate free speech because what youtube did was anti-free speech but now this is the most 2020 thing ever leafy's here came back christmas eve it's a fucking christmas miracle the hype started before the video even dropped he started tweeting 1k subscribers shout out to all that motherfuckers say i never make it then he links to his new youtube channel which i'm going to link in the description wefi something funny that happened is that at one point he had 11.4 thousand subscribers and then a the second later he had 5.1 that most likely was youtube detecting a high number of subscribers to a new account and they had to verify and delete half of them or something like that and i've seen a lot of people say that this channel is going to be terminated the same thing is going to happen give it a day give it a week leafy in his bio says this channel is owned by Red Blooms, and then it says Leafy is a content creator hired by Red Blooms. So this is a loophole to get around the whole situation. Leafy was hired by this company. I don't know if you guys are early enough to know this, but Kim started something similar with Drama Alert. He doesn't really own Drama Alert. And I want to see the reaction of people who were laughing at Leafy when he got terminated. I want to see Ethan's reaction. I want to see Idub's reaction. I want to see all of these fucking people who were celebrating the fall of Leafy, who were celebrating the fact that a content creator got terminated unfairly, by the way. For no reason, there were no prior strikes. Yes, he had two strikes. They were removed. And before he got terminated, he had none. Zero. Nada. What YouTube did was 100% anti-free speech. And before the fucking nerd comes at me with a fucking YouTube turn on servers. Well, sensitive. Uh, you can't upload multiple videos on someone because that's bullying or harassment. And Leafy made like 15 Pokemon videos. Two of them. Maximum three were Pokemon related. The rest, he was just shitting on her <laughs> at that point. But I don't get it. If Leafy got terminated for making multiple, multiple Pokemon Pokemon videos, why aren't people like the H3 podcast terminated? I mean, have you seen how many times they've talked about Keemstar? I don't want H3 to be terminated. I'm just saying, why doesn't YouTube apply the rules equally? Leafy made 10 Pokemon videos that isn't allowed. Okay, terminate him. How much videos does H3H3 podcast have on Keemstar? 15, 20, 30, 35? Why isn't he terminated then? He's doing the same thing. What's the difference? I know what the difference is. Leafy isn't family friendly. Fucking H3H3 H3 broke the rules years ago with making how many Logan Paul or Jake Paul videos. The rules aren't applied equally to everyone. And whoever says otherwise is a fucking idiot. I'm glad Leafy... I Weefy, it's going to take a minute to get used to it. Fucking four years of calling him Leaf. I'm glad he's back. I'm looking forward to his content. He made a video explaining the whole situation. I'm just going to link it below so you guys can see. It's three minutes long. Hey everybody, so as you all know, my channel, Leafy is Here, was banned a few months ago. Mm. Bro, my computer is like overloading right now. It's like there's too much heat, son. <laughs>